DR Congo's victory at the 2016 African Nations Championship is still celebrated across the football mad nation. The players who were part of winning the country's second title are now eyeing another competition, the 2017 Africa Cup of Nations qualifiers. The coach told us during chant that some of us would be part of the Cup of Nations squad. So we are expectant because ultimately that is where each player wants to play. But there's a lot of talent to choose from, so we must up our game. In a country with a large number of foreign-based players who often get priority in the Cup of Nations games, the technical bench is in for a selection balancing act. DR Congo host Group B leaders Angola next month in their bid to reach Gabon 2017. Chan proved we have good domestic-based players thanks to a competitive league which has many clubs. But there are even better players abroad and so it will prove a headache to us. But what is important is we select on merit. In the late 60s and the early 70s, the Democratic Republic of Congo was a force to reckon with in African football, winning two continental titles. And in 1974, they became the first sub-Saharan team to reach a FIFA World Cup. It would then take them almost four decades to come closer to the African title once again. In 2015, they were third at the Cup of Nations. The third place finishes saw the team reach their highest FIFA ranking of 46th in the world last February. A year later, though, they have dropped 10 places. There is, however, optimism that they remain on the right path. The improvements we saw in the national team come from the motivation the team receives from the government. Today, unlike the past, players want to not just appear for the national team, but are driven to win. Recently, the Chan winners were awarded luxury cars worth 60,000 US dollars by the government. And while the Chan victory still lingers, the nation is aware the Cup of Nations is a different ball game. The Leopards lost their last match to the Central African Republic, whose political situation means they cannot host matches at home. Those who make it to the Leopards squad will be keen to get three points. Celestine Karone, CCTV, Lubumbashi, the Democratic Republic of Congo.